spontaneous mixing of two gases. Consider two containers, one containing neon gas and another containing helium gas. These are connected by means of a valve as shown. The containers are perfectly insulated so that no heat enters or leaves the system. The two gases are non-reacting, being inert gases. When the valve is opened, we observe that the two gases get mixed together spontaneously. During the mixing, there is a negligible energy change, and therefore, the criterion of decrease of energy for feasibility of process does not help us. On observing closely to the final and initial states of system, we observe that in the initial state the two gases are orderly filled separately in the two containers. On the other hand, after mixing, helium and neon are distributed between both the containers. In other words, each gas occupies a large volume in the final state, and thereby number of possible locations for the molecules of each gas is increased. This means that there is more disorder or randomness on mixing. Thus, the gases mix spontaneously to achieve more randomness.